Welcome to a new learning management system, Cornerstone. Cornerstone has replaced Grovo as our source for online, on-demand learning content. To get started, you want to bookmark the homepage, which is ahcchcn.csod.com. CSOD standing for Cornerstone On Demand. Type your email address in the username section, and when you're first signing in, select Forgot Password or click Forgot Password. That'll take you to a page where you will be sent an email link to reset your password. Reset your email password, put it in the password section, and hit login. After you've, excuse me, after you've logged in, you'll be taken to our home page, and this is the learner home page. I'll be navigating the page, so follow my cursor um, as we go through each of the sections. I'm also going to go over just the basics in this video, and Cornerstone is a really comprehensive platform, and I know that you'll be able to find lots of your own favorite functionalities. Once you find some of those favorites, be sure to add it into the Slack page as well, so we can all share whatever our favorite courses and favorite uh, tips and tricks about Cornerstone. So let's take a look around the home page. The first thing to know is that where my cursor currently stands at the AHC CHCN login is one way that you can always come back to this home page from any spot on the website. So by hitting this icon, you'll be returned to this home page. Now let's take a look at this vertical banner on the left side of the home page. So let's review a few of the functions here. The completions tab at the top takes you to your transcript and your transcript will show you a list of all of the trainings that you've, cre uh, that you've completed in addition to all of your active trainings, which mean trainings that are either assigned to you that you haven't started or trainings that are assigned to you that you have already started. And there are many ways to, to get back to this transcript page that I'll go over on the home page. And this is really true of most things on Cornerstone. There are many routes to the same destination. So as you become more accustomed to this, you're going to find your preferences and select the preferences and ways to get to those same destinations that you prefer. For example, this home icon takes you back to the home page, as does the AHC CHCN logo. Scrolling down, you have an option to add subjects into your subjects page. So what your subjects are is just a way to classify your interests and you can add your interests and then the system will select courses, recommend courses for you in this top pick section over here and also list courses when we go to searching that are more in alignment with your preferred subjects. Coming down here to your playlists, Playlists are customized collections of trainings you want to take. You can design playlists to meet your training needs uh, by either creating a new playlist or adding additional trainings to playlists that you've already created. So if you want to create a new playlist, we can title this communication. And we've now created a new playlist. This is the page for that new playlist and you add courses from this add from catalog section. So I can type in communication. And this drop down bar shows you just the, the first 10 or so courses that come up. You can also then search the catalog for a list of those courses as well. And we'll come back to the search for catalog. So once you've gone to the create playlist page, you can now take a look. In this case, Angel has three different playlists. He has communications, emotional intelligence, and admin, admin skills. And from there, you can hit these three buttons to delete them and also click on them to add courses. So as I said, this is about communication. So let's type in communication. Let's find, let's put the communication toolkit in there and add it to the playlist. We can add another one. Let's type in nonverbal communication. There we go and use nonverbal communication during your presentation. Let's add this. So now this playlist has two different courses that Angel can take when he's ready, and you could view the courses either in this timeline or on a list. As I mentioned, this home icon and the AHC CHCN logo will take you back to the same page. And as we said, most things in Cornerstone, there are many directions that take you to the same destination. Excuse me as I scroll this down. 
So this is also true for your transcripts. We saw that you can hit, you can access your transcript by hitting this completions tab. And you could also access your transcript by hitting this view link right over here. And as mentioned, your transcript is essentially a list of completed and in progress courses. So in addition to checking out your completions, uh, you can check out courses you've completed and courses that you currently have as well, which we've seen already here. So Angel has five courses in progress. So he has five trainings that he needs to complete. When we go back to the home page, we see that those same courses are also available and also launchable from the do soon section. So we can launch them from here or from the transcript. By hitting these three buttons, you can learn a little bit more about each of those trainings that are assigned. You get, the, you get that it's an online course. You're told which provider it has. We have, we have about 10 providers that we have access to. You see how long the course is and you get a brief description and the training due date. In addition to assigned trainings, which you can see on this do soon section or through your transcript, you can also search for any training that fits your professional and personal needs. You could do this in multiple places. We saw that one of the places you could do that is through the, through the playlist function. And two other places you can do that is here in this red banner. There's a search function in the red banner. And there's also another search icon in the blue banner. And it doesn't matter which one you hit. But let's select a topic. Let's look at emotional intelligence. If I just type in emotional intelligence and don't hit enter, I get a drop down of the first 10 or so classes that um, are available. But once I hit enter, I'm then taken to that course catalog that we saw earlier, which has just more descriptions of the courses, including something I think is really important, which is the duration of the course, because then you can find courses that really fit how much time you have. And one way to filter all of these results is to look at this left section over here and take a look at how long these courses are. As you can see, all courses, um, most courses are under, under two hours. Many, the majority of the courses are actually less than 15 minutes. And that's the truth for most of the courses on Cornerstone. They're all really, they're pretty fast. You can get through many courses in under 15 minutes. Another thing you can do is you can take a look at different subjects. So not only are you looking at emotional intelligence, but maybe emotional intelligence as it applies to health and wellness, leadership and management, personal development, and so on. And finally, you can take a look at providers. So maybe you start to notice that you really, really like the classes that Big Think offers. And Big Think is one of the catalogs that, that has leaders and pioneers in their fields come and give kind of like TED Talks. Um, there is also a, a TED Talk function. Thrive Learning is mostly animated courses. Grovo, we know from our other, from our, our previous learning management system. And Biz Library often has a lot of more technical skill trainings. So again, many ways to, to really narrow down your search here. This three-lined icon is the navigation menu, which is yet another way to get to the same destination. So uh, mostly you'll be spending this time in learning. And Learner Home right here is that Learner Home page. Playlists is the playlist page. Viewing your transcript shows you, takes you right back to the transcript page where you can see a list of all of your in progress and completed courses. And the events calendar would be where we would list in-person trainings, which won't be going on for some time. So hang on tight there. Shortly, you'll all receive a new user curriculum email from Grovo, excuse me, from Cornerstone, which will collect, which will link you to four short classes you're gonna complete. You can use this curriculum not only as a way to build new skills, but also as an opportunity to navigate the Cornerstone platform. As with all new technology, there'll be a learning curve in understanding and seamlessly moving through the platform. Use your interests and skill gaps to help guide you in your exploration of Cornerstone and reach out to me anytime if you have any questions. Thank you very much.